Hello, it's Toronto immigration lawyer Max Chowdhury. I want to discuss a common issue, often for self-file candidates, those persons who have sought to file for their own work permit or study or visitor visa, not to mention permanent resident case. That issue is requesting reconsideration. This occurs when an officer makes a decision that is negative and you think your case should not have been negative. So, a request for reconsideration may work to overturn or erase the refusal leading to visa issuance. One question is, when is a request for reconsideration done? Reconsideration would be done after a refusal for a visa which you think should not have been refused. How is it done? You should try to highlight the factors in the decision which show an officer's failure to consider a certain fact or misinterpretation of a fact. Ideally, you should try to show documents that were already submitted before the refusal should have been enough to grant the visa. In rare cases, you can include a missing document such as a police clearance or a passport copy particularly where the missing document relates to a narrow ground of admissibility rather than a more subjective question such as whether you should have been issued a visa based on your particular work or study history. In some cases, it helps to cite the particular law that an officer must follow, such as the criteria for a particular visa, such as study, work, or visiting, not to mention other categories such as Canada Experience Class. This may mean researching and citing cases that are similar to your refusal. Also, it's ideal to have knowledge of government policies or the government manual that is pertinent. Then those can be cited as well. Getting the reconsideration sent out would entail using the online CSE or Client Specific Enquiry System and or the coordinates contained in the refusal. These may include an email address of an immigration officer. Once filed, you must wait for the result. How long to wait for this result? Keep in mind that it may become too late to appeal or seek judicial review if the refusing officer does not change her mind before the deadline for court. The time for an appeal or judicial review may be as little as 15 days, so you may wish to get advice about seeking an appeal or judicial review even if the officer does not get back to you, especially within the time frame for the appeal. If you've received a refusal or a visa uh, of a visa or work permit and are seeking reconsideration, contact Chaudhary Law Office. Thank you.